Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Roxanne, this is Jelly Rambles, uh, and tonight we are doing Season 5, Episode 7 of Ages of S.H.I.E.L.D. It's called Together or Not at All. So we start off with um, Fitz uh, removes Gemma's implant while they're trying to escape, and then Daisy um, fights off a Kree guard that interrupts them. Then we have Fitz's ship um, literally exploded, and then we have the Kree brother... Um, takes over from Cassius. I think this is, yeah, Cassius. And um, this is his own people after Daisy and everybody. Then Sonar questions um, a guy, and then we have the Kree uh, cut the power to the elevator, because that's where they think they're going to go. And then we have May on Earth with the roaches. And then have Enoch um, saves her from them. And then um, there's a gravitational storm approaching, so um, they're about to be left up in the air, but someone catches them and hooks them and saves them. Then we have Kree is searching for uh, Flint, uh, which is the inhuman that got turned two episodes ago, I believe. So then we have uh, Coulson tells Flint about Tess, because he's starting to freak out, freak out, but what about Tess? Where's Tess at? So they finally tell him about that, and then we have the Cree brothers talk, Cassius and his brother talk, and it, it's not pretty. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then uh, we have Fitz uh, found uh, Gravitonium when they are trying to escape from the Cree. They get into this room, and they open this panel that has Gravitonium run through it, and that's how there's artificial gravity on this on the base. And then the Kree uh, jumps in and shoots Fit, so he gets shot at and gets hit. And then um, they escape thanks to Daisy, who fights off the guy and lets off steam, so they have enough cover to escape. Then they run into Deke, and they um, helps them out and helps them get out of the situation. And then we have Mac talks to Flint about like it's not your fault. It, believe it or not, it does not really get easier. <laughs> Uh, and then we cut to where the team is reunited, and then um, when that happens, Flint left and escaped. Basically, he turns himself into the Kree, and uh, then he offs them. He formed a rock into like a dagger type thing, went and took out the Kree guards. And then Sonara he owes Flint. And once he gets his bait, then Daisy sees that and offers herself. And then Cole, um, Colson usually, um, shot at her, <laughs> Sonara, but as long as, like, a arm wound, then we have Colson su suggest to go to the surface, because that's where everything's been pinpointing to, so that's where they're going. And then, uh, Flint barricades the door, and then we have the Kree are trying, um, basically are busting holes through, like, so it's like a big, big shotgun that can go through solid cinder block and try to make a circle so they can get in there. But so while they're doing that, the team escapes. And then when they break down the door, Sonara also um, the brother's Kree's guard. And then Flint, um, when they get to the ship, Flint says he's going to stay. And then Mac and Yo-Yo stay with him. And then we have the um, then we have the team leaving the base. So then Fitz um, puts um, then Fitz tells Mac that there is show tech on level three. And that's where they came in. That's where all the alien roaches are. And they're like, "What? <laughs> you couldn't tell us that sooner." <laughs> so they say their goodbyes, and then they leave the base. And then the Cree brother uh, wants an art on his team. Um, and Cassius is not having that, and literally, um, asks him, and they, he goes a little cray-cray, and then he's, I don't know what he's trying to do, to be honest with you, I mean, he just wants to be the, I guess, the god of the earth or something, and then, um, yeah, <laughs> Then we have that, then we have um, Fitzsimmons talk, and then um, they start to crash, and then we, um, and then in the last few minutes, we see that May and Enoch are okay, and turns out the person that rescued them is an old lady, and that old lady is Robin. 
So that was the end of the episode. I was like, oh my god. And plus, how old is this girl, this woman now? Robin was like, I think nine, I think like 80 years into the future or something. So I was like, dang. So that's really cool. I'm, I cannot wait for next week's episode. Apparently that this is where everything goes down for, a, it's kind of like a mid-season finale. I don't know if they're going to break or not. I don't know the schedule or anything. So anyway, uh, this episode was really good. I really liked it. So uh, I'll give this A+. Plus. I really enjoyed the episode. It was fantastic to me. I liked everything about it. Um, I'm very excited to see what's going to happen next. And... <laughs> Just anything that's going to be happening, I'm just excited. I'm just very excited for it. I think it's going to be super cool, and I cannot freaking wait. And um, I like uh, it's like how the team reunited and how they're just trying to formulate plans and stuff. So it was kind of refreshing to see them get back into that type of groove. So um, that's pretty much it. So that's what I did for this video. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, and then subscribe. And then also for the comments, just let me know what you want to hear as far as music and or TV shows or movies. Just let me know down below and I'll be happy to take a look at it. And I have a bunch I've got to do. And then uh, guess what? All the DC shows are going back on next week or in three days. <laughs> So that's going to be really interesting. So um, I got a lot of stuff I got to record. So I'm going to be trying to do that tomorrow. Anyway, I want you all on a super awesome day. I'll see you all next video. And have an awesome day. Bye, everybody.